What's the difference between a VPS and a dedicated server? Let's say you own a flat in an apartment building. The flat is 100% yours. Your neighbors can just barge in there. However, you also don't own the entire building. You're just one out of many flats. That means you can't decorate the entire building if you have a family location. With a dedicated server, you own the entire building that is the hardware and the software. But this also comes at a much higher price point than a VPS. Other than the price point, dedicated server also lag in scalability. Whereas you can easily add more resources to your VPS server, therefore it's scalable. So which one should you choose? Depends on your use case. If you're building a SaaS app, then I would recommend just go for a dedicated server. But for anything else, I would choose a VPS. This includes blog websites, branded sites, e-commerce stores, membership, and online course sites. There's tons of famous VPS providers you can choose from, but I highly recommend check out the full video on my channel to get the full picture. Subscribe for more horizontal and vertical videos.